Good morning, everyone. How are you? Today, we're going to go through and look at everything from each advent calendar. So, for Bob Ross, we got an activity, wisdom for the day. We got this beautiful ornament. This one, another Christmas activity, another Christmas activity, another Christmas activity. <laughs> we got this one a minute. There we go. Here we've got an audio and another audio and another audio 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 okay so you can tell that they had them all grouped together probably for the wiring all the audios were in this part so they had the wiring for the audio and uh, then over here we had Squirrel ornament. Wisdom for the day. Wisdom for the day. Wisdom. We have this ornament. This one. Another Christmas activity and a wisdom for the day. And then it ended with the Bob Ross Holiday Reflections Journal. I, I definitely loved this. I definitely think it was worth the money, in my opinion, because I love Bob Ross so much. So uh, that is... A definite um, score in my opinion <laughs> all right we'll be back with the next one one moment all right here we are back with art by Marmalene from Studio Light and we got this desk calendar whoopsie sorry we got this desk calendar that sits on your desk and it's got the numbered part there and then the little lines here where you can write something on and it has this blank spot and if you join our, the Facebook group every month throughout the year next year there will be a monthly project to decorate this blank part so that'll be fun using all of these items so we got Three ink pads by Studio Light. Pink, black, and teal. And we got a bunch of stamps. We have this yoga pose lady. Got these flowers. We also have uh, these paper pads here. This one's ornament shape. And they're really thick cardstock. And then this one's just a fun shape. Here is one of those tags. And it comes, then one of the stamps we got um, fits the tag. We got these fun little kids. And this thing here that says, May the night sky kiss your soul and carry your sh sorrows. Now, this center stamp is not um, from this one, but the border stamp is. 
And then you'll see this one in the next advent. We had got these both on the same day and I just combined them. We got this little flower stamp and the sunrise or sunset or modern mandala. There we go. We got this super fun puffer fish on his way to a birthday party. We got these fun little triangles, doodled triangles, and a raven or a crow. The word happy, and I was happy with this advent. We got this pretty lady. This one. Got this cute little girl with her crown. This fun little snail. And we got this cute little doodled bird. And uh, then we got an acrylic block. And we got this stamp of a town. So overall, I was really happy with it. Um, what did you guys think? Did you guys like it? I know some people commented that they didn't, but honestly, I didn't have any of this. So I was really happy. Um, be right back with the next one. Hold on. All right, we are back with Crafter's Companion. Alrighty, so let's just get started. We got this stamp that I put on the center of the round border die from the other advent. And then I, from the other advent, I used the, one of the uh, ornaments dies with this gingerbread stamp. We got a stencil, floral stencil. We got this beautiful uh, floral and butterfly corner die. All right, here we go. We got this die set with the leaves and the acorns. We got this reindeer die. Got this picnic basket stamp. We got this tree stamp and die set. Got a happy birthday stencil. Got um, a snowflake die. Got this cute little scarf, mittens, and hat stamp and die set. And then we got this uh, candy canes and bows stamp and die set. Spring, autumn, summer, and winter stamp set. Got a cherry blossom embossing folder. Got this heart stamp. Love you, just for you, me and you, and be mine stamp set. We got the bow stamp and die set. We got a hello die. Then here's another embossing folder. 
that we got. And another embossing folder. We got this floral stamp and die set that, as you can see, got some water on it. <laughs> We got a wood grain embossing die. I mean, uh, embossing folder. We got this butterfly edge piece die. And my favorite is this hot cocoa stamp and die set. Super cute. That was my favorite piece of them all. Except for the Four Seasons 6x6 six six paper pad culminated the whole advent and I thought it was absolutely great. We got some um, cut aparts in the back. Winter, fall, summer, and spring. And then it's a paper pad that goes through all four seasons. I was really impressed with that and I really liked that a lot. And then, all right guys, I'll be right back with the next one. I'm back. All right, so up next we had our mindfulness advent from embracingmindfulness.com. And I don't know about you guys, but I really enjoyed this one. Uh, tell me, did you guys do any of the prompts? I definitely did. I didn't do all of them. For example, going for a walk, I'm not able to do right now. But I, uh, it definitely caused me to be a lot more mindful in my day-to-day -day life, which is a very positive thing. So I was very happy with this one as well. I'll be right back. All right, and last but not least is our Sage Goddess Gifts of Gratitude, which I think you guys can tell is my favorite. I loved them all, but this was amazing. So we got this elephant pendant with the green adventuring on it. We got some peppermint lip balm. We got this amazing banded agate bracelet. We got this aura coated blue chalcedony, druzy chalcedony, with all those gorgeous colors in it. Beautiful. We got this gorgeous blue kyanite with black tourmaline. A fun double pointed smoky quartz points on a keychain. Got this fun beeswax candle with glitter. We got our Relax Mist that can be used to spray yourself and your room. We've got Winter Sandalwood Solid Perfume. We have Forest Floor Perfume. We have our beautiful Chakra Tassel. And we have our Labradorite Ganesha. Gorgeous. Um, I have to say that I loved all four Advents. I am extremely happy with all four ad Advents. I'm happy that I got all of them. They were all very different in their own way. My favorite by far is the sage goddess uh, my second favorite was bob ross and then the two crafting advents were tied for third place 
and I really enjoyed the mindfulness one as well because um, it really helped me pay attention to the positive this month, which is a really good thing after the last few months. This year's been tough as it has for everybody and it was taking a toll on me. But the mindfulness advent really helped me look at the positive side of things this month so that I could enjoy this month and let go of the stress and negativity. So overall, extremely happy. It's been a lot of fun. I will definitely do this again in the future. Tell me which one was your guys' favorite down below or what your favorite item was, either way. And I hope you all have an amazing day. I will see you later.